friends, I am out and about again. I am on my way to do an errand, and as you can see, I'm outside a building, and it says here that this is the site of 72 Willow Street, birthplace of Barbara Pym, novelist, 1913 to 1980. So Barbara Pym was a novelist in her day, and she came from this town, and on this site is the place where she was born. It's a pity the building isn't here, because it's the sort of thing might have been a museum to now, but that's never going to happen. But I'm outside it, and I was going to go down the road and show you something else. Ever since 2012, when you had the Olympics, and I believe the torch passed through this town, unfortunately I didn't get to see it, they put bunting up. They put it up every summer. And you can see it here in the background, just behind me. It makes the town centre look lovely. A bit like Christmas all summer, only it's not lights, it's bunting. Even more bunting, have a good look at it. There you go, bunting, it looks lovely. I always look forward to seeing it. What a pity it's going to come down soon and then we'll be into the darkness of September and autumn and then winter. Never mind, next year the spring will be coming and just before that we have Christmas when the lights will go up. Have a look at the flowers behind me, aren't they lovely? And if I just swing round, you can see in the background the Istanbul Barbers. This seems to have caught on up and down the country that men are looking for a bit more than just a haircut. They want to be pampered and shaved and hot towel. I've never done it myself because, well, I am the age I am. And I think if you get pampered one day, well, then you don't get pampered the next day. So what's the point? But evidently this is very fashionable and makes people feel good. And so they have the Istanbul Barbers, even though we're in Britain. And here we are just having a closer look at the Istanbul Barbers. You almost feel like you must be in Turkey. And it's certainly interesting to see the staff. So you get a little taste of Turkey, even if it is in your jaw and your, the top of your head. Barbers. And here I am right in the middle of town. You can see the flowers. And once again, behind me, you can see the bunting. And it's all the way down that street as well. It looks gorgeous. Absolutely lovely. And I personally think that the old buildings in the town make the town centre look nice, such as the one behind me. That looks a bit Tudor to me. Or maybe it's mock Tudor. I wouldn't know. I don't know enough about architecture. But you've had a look at the town. And you can have a, a good look all the way down the street that's just, that's just behind me and see the bunting there. I photograph the bunting every year, but this year I'm filming it. There, have a good look. And again, you see the Tudor looking building. It's just there on the corner behind me, this way. There, right over my shoulder, the Tudor looking building. It's lovely.